Hi, everybody. Hi, Remote Wolfies. Uh, so this is Ms. Nunez explaining what we're doing this week, uh, which will begin uh, on January. What will it be? January 25th already. Wow, time is flying. Uh, so by the end of this week, I can still change your grade if you did not receive a passing grade. Uh, but hurry up because I keep opening things, trying to grade them. I have to click so many things to it, even open it. Uh, so hurry up, okay? Because I'm having to go back all the way to lessons one through five, then six through 10, and then 11 through 15. And wow, uh, right now we're on 31 through 35. So uh, I'm going to move forward and show you what we're going to be doing this week. So you can see that I am uh, sharing my screen and I'd like you to see what we're doing. And in order to do that, I can't send it to you until, I mean, I can't show you it until uh, I have clicked through it. So you know that there's a little thing Latin here. Roots. We have seen these before. It's going to explain what Latin roots are. And so you have that Latin root practice. Uh, word slam. Uh, word slams have come to you before. And there's a secret here that you need to know about. So usually you see the little man on the top right that has accessibility options or some instructions. But if you see a little box next to it, oh, you got to click that because it shows you all the words. So these are the word bank uh, options that you have. So when you look at the list and you think, gee, I have no idea what that is, uh, look for... Um, the word list, because then you can see uh, which ones are in the list. And that kind of gives you um, some help. So uh, stealth, I'll help you with the first one. If something is a, a secret, like that stealth bomber airplane, that's um, stealthily if somebody is doing something in secret. So I gave you the first one for free because you're watching this video. Uh, I really am looking forward to this assignment where you're going to write an explanatory essay. So you're going to explain something. And, you know, you may not have a social studies class, uh, so I'm just going to tell you, you can use something in the news. So think about events that have been happening lately, like the inauguration of Biden, yay. And uh, so there have been some issues, some historical events that have been going on, like the COVID vaccine. Oh, can't wait to get mine. So what I'd like you to do is uh, write a really solid essay. This is going to count big points here. You're going to start with an introduction, like there have been a lot of people talking about the vaccine. There have been some worries that the anti-vaxxers think that it hurts you. We're afraid, blah, blah, blah. So you're going to start with a big, giant introduction, very general, okay? Don't give any details. The next paragraph is the body. There, you start with a big idea, and then you give details, examples, explanations, evidence, and then you analyze a little bit, okay? So even though people may think there's pros and cons with the vaccine, or even though people love or hate Biden, whatever, um, it's up to each person to make their own decision. And then the conclusion. Don't say in conclusion. That is so middle school. So um, think about ways, like when we consider all the pros and cons, people have to think about blah, 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 blah. So say people, 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 and um, review. Review the big idea, review the details and punch it in the face and maybe take a step to the future with a conclusion. Okay, so that one is your big assignment for the week. Um, word reading 
uh, you've had six other word readings and you know that this one after the video, uh, if you don't see that little box on the top, um, this is pretty easy, just words that begin with shh, and then words that start with a blend, a consonant blend. Uh, so letters that have, um, or end rather, with a consonant blend. Uh, and then this word reading, you will see that again, it has that introductory uh, paragraph that explains and it's a fill in the blank. Uh, and then the study spelling plan, you know, we've got to get good at spelling and there you'll see there's a lot of misspelled words that we think that's how you write it so you have a learning target that says you know how to spell things right oh wow address address i have to think about it every single time whenever i write it too so uh it's like a review for your spelling so um those are the assignments latin roots word slam explanatory essay and this is what I do to send them to you. And I'll be grading whatever you have. So I see six assignments this week. If you do a little bit each day, it won't be a big deal. And remember, email me sometime every week and Zoom with me once a week. Okay, you're lost in La La Land, so far away. I need to see your face and I need to talk with you because we have a learning target that says you can talk to me. So I'll be asking you some questions, getting you to talk. So don't forget, Zoom with me, okay? Uh, Wednesday and Thursday, 1.30, but quite frankly, I open, I open Zoom every day at 1.30. So if you open it up and you say hi, that'd be great, okay? All right, see you guys around. I hope. Don't forget me and see you around. Yep. Me bomb, me bomb.